Hi, this is Mr. V and in this video we're going to learn how to calculate the area of a compound shape. So a compound shape is a shape that is made of a couple of basic shapes stuck together. So for example, this uh, ice cream cone kind of looking shape is made out of a triangle down the bottom and a semicircle on the top. So the way we're going to ca calculate the area of this shape is by breaking it up into the two component shapes, area 1 and area 2, calculating them separately and then adding them up. So area 1. Area 1 is, obviously is a triangle and if we use this as the base we can use that as the height. So 20 centimeters is going to be my base times 24 is my height and of course I've got to divide that by 2 because it's a triangle 20 divided by uh, sorry, times by 24 divided by 2 equals 240 and this is centimeters squared Now the area of this semicircle, so area 2, is going to be the area of a circle, pi r squared, and we have half a circle, so it's going to be a half pi r squared. A half times pi times, alright, I know here my diameter, my, my radius is going to be half of that, so my radius is going to be half of 20, which is 10. So times 10 squared. My calculator, 1 divided by 2 times pi times 10 squared equals 157. And we'll round it to a whole number. And it, again, it's centimeters squared. And so the total area of this shape is going to be these two added up. So area equals area 1 plus area 2 which is 240 plus 157, which is 397 centimeters squared. Great. <coughs> this shape over here is a compound shape as well. But you'll notice this is not exactly uh, two shapes stuck together. Rather, it is one shape that has a hole taken out of it, which is another shape over here. So we actually have two shapes here. We've got a rectangle, and then we've got this triangle that's been cut out. So the way we're going to deal with that is we're going to calculate the area of um, the hole. We're going to calculate the area of the rectangle, the main shape, and we're going to subtract the two. So I will start with uh, the triangle in this case. So uh, this is 21. We know that this whole length over here is 47. So the leftover bit here has to be 47 minus 21. And 47 minus 21 is 26. So this length is 26. The perpendicular height is 27. And so the area of that shape is going to be a half base times height, which is going to be a half of 26 by 27, which is 351 centimeters squared. You'll notice that the order in which I calculate these separately doesn't actually matter. Uh, as long as you stick them together at the end correctly. So 2 is a rectangle, so it's length times width. The length of my rectangle is 58. By the width is 47. And 58 by 47 is 2,726 centimeters squared. And so because we're 
taking this away, we, we, we're cutting this shape out, our, our total area is going to be the area of the rectangle, which we label as area 2, minus the area of the triangle, which we label as area 1. So it's going to be 2726 minus 351, and that is equal to 2375 square centimeters. And that is how we can calculate the area of a compound shape.